Sometimes I feel like I'm just standing around It's getting me down Looking for the other side Um, my personal connection with Gil Scott Heron was that he influenced me in terms of writing. Um, Ice is a lot of different things, and part of it, because I had knew, known his work, and um, as, a, as a, I was in school during the time that Gil Scott Heron was out there as an activist. I went to Emerson College in Boston, and Boston was like a, a hotbed of a political activity. And the things that he said about Johannesburg and Pieces of a Man and being in the bottle, the lyrics, what, st what hit me so hard was the lyrics, because you get a lot of what call, I call frivolous lyrics and music, even though I like the music and stuff like that. But I think what he did was actually pave the way for him and people like the young Pope young poet, last poets, paved the way for like a lot of the hip hop and rap music that's happening now. So um, his love of words and the way that he expressed himself was very, very important to me in terms of my own political development and in my own literary de development. Um, after reading uh, uh, The Last Holiday, I feel like I know him because of the way he puts, the way he uses words, the way he takes the words and makes rhythms out of it, the way he takes the words and switches them and t makes up his own words. Love was not an active verb in my family or in my life. There were very few demonstrations, few hugs and embraces, and few declarations among us about love. I was a full-grown adult who had been married, a father, and divorced before I consciously put, I love you into conversations with my mother before I made sure I got a hug from her and gave her a big hug each time we met.